Well, it's been more than three years since an App State student literally vanished from campus. Boone police say the search continues, but they're running out of leads. NBC Charlotte and defender Michelle Bowden joins us now with tonight's Carolina's cold case. Over the years, police have done dozens of searches across the entire Boone region, and they tell me there's never been any sign of Martin. <laughs> you know, it's been over three years. Martin Roberts vanished from the App State campus in April 2016. His dad and family heartbroken, desperate to know what happened. We still have hope because we don't have a reason not to have hope. This area here is heavily wooded, so we searched all this area here. Boone police are stumped. They've searched the woods near his apartment, area lakes, brought in cadaver dogs. So in all the searches that you guys did, was there ever any sign of him at any point? No, we found no sign. Martin was a sophomore at App State. People flock to Boone because it's an idyllic location. Um, it's peaceful here. A piece still shattered because of this mystery. I'm still getting calls on a weekly basis. Martin's cousin was the last known person to see him. She ran into him at a bus stop on the edge of campus. You can see him here caught on camera. Which show him walking away from the bus stop towards the intersection of River Street. And that's the last we see of him. He left behind a note at the apartment he shared with a few roommates. Both the police and his dad are reluctant to call it a suicide note. It was kind of vague and just mentioned that he wasn't happy with where he was and what was going on and, and needed to make a change. But from there, we don't know what the change was. Police say when they were finally able to access his cell phone two years after he disappeared, Martin had turned off the location services the day before he was last seen at that bus stop. Does that tell you anything? Can that help you draw any conclusions that he purposely turned off the location services of his phone? Maybe he was just trying to disconnect from others. Still, with no body and no sign of Martin, his family just needs to know. You would think after this this time, one way or the other, something would have turned up. He was, he's a very special person to us, and we miss him and, and love him tremendously. Police are hoping this story will generate some new leads. If you've got any information in this case, you could get your hands on a $10,000 reward. All you need to do, call Boone Police. That number, 828-268-6900. Again, there is a $10,000 cash reward if you can help solve this case. Reporting in Boone, Michelle Bowden, NBC Charlotte.